Welcome to LearningEngineer.com, where we engineer learning for efficiency. My name is Michael Langdon. I'm your host. And if you need to reach me, you can reach me at michael.langdon at LearningEngineer.com, which you can see right here in my resume. Today I'm going to show you how to set up a template-like file that allows you to quickly enter information into a, a document that you've already set up. And this is how we're going to do this. So you can see here that I already have a resume set up and all laid out the way I want it to be. And so I just want to go in and change this so that anyone could then take this format and use this. And I'm going to show you how to do that. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to go up here and you can see that I'm at, currently at the home tab and I need to click on the insert tab and then I'm going to come over here to quick parts and I'm going to click on the bottom part of quick parts here and I'm going to click field. Um, first actually I have to decide where I'm going to put this field. So I'm going to put this field right here. I got to delete that first. So I got to come back up to quick parts, sorry. And click field. And then what I want to do is I want to scroll down to where it says macro button. Okay? And then once you've selected macro button and it's highlighted, you want to come down to where it says field codes button and click on that. And then you want to select this here and you can cl either select it click and drag across or you can just double click on it and we want to type in no name and then in brackets click here to enter your name and another bracket and since I'm going to reuse this I'm going to actually select this right here and I'm gonna hold down the control key tap the C key and that's gonna copy that and now I'm gonna click OK and you can see here that it puts this click here to enter your name and so if I click here you can see it highlights it and if I just start typing in my name it will add in my name nice and you can do the same thing over here. You can also change the formatting of this. So I'm going to undo this by hitting Control Z. So it's back here. And so when you have this selected, if you want to, I'm going to go back to the Home tab. I could actually change this from 12 to 11 point, uh, italicize it, and all of that formatting will be attached to whatever you type there at the end. Okay, so we could do the same thing for the address here. We could do the delete this. Oops. We still want the line there. And then we go back to insert, quick parts, field. We come down to macro button here. We click field codes here. And now all I have to do is highlight that and hold down the control key, tap the V key while I have the control key held down. Okay, and then we're gonna just we're gonna change this here to address. And then we click OK. And then we're gonna do this one here as well. Same thing. Macro button. Field codes paste and here we're just going to put city and click OK and you can see that our city is there so if we want to change that we just click on it there and voila so you get an idea how you could set up a 
especially a newsletter or a flyer or something that changes quite frequently but you want the same layout and design and a resume of course uh, thanks from the learning engineer I hope you enjoyed this